Hey guys, what's up? Majestic Gaming here, and uh, they just revealed the full rec reveal for Ghost Meridian, which is coming probably next week or week after next, sometime soon. And uh, it comes with a lot of cool stuff, even though it's kind of just another rec update. It's, yeah. it's better than Battle of Shadow and Light, so. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so uh, you want to start off with that Dynast armor set? Uh, ooh, I. I, uh, I, I like the helmet, not only really the armor. It's... The, the helmet kind of reminds me of like Athlon mis mixed with Stalker and a couple yeah. other things. It's weird. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Um, um, Mark V Alpha. Um, I, just, I hate Mark V. And this game is so hard. It. Yeah, no. Just no, no. Come on, bring Mark V Bravo. Mark IV is pretty much Mark, what I would assume yeah. Mark V Bravo would look like. Um, Skirmish at Dark Star, which looks like a really cool map. Yeah. Um, I We saw some pictures from it. It looks pretty cool, not too much in it. Uh, there's going to be interactive gates outside of the home bases. So, yeah, scripting. <laughs> it uh, it looks pretty cool. I can't. I mean, I think that should be a pretty fun map to play on. I agree. And uh, apparently, there's also going to be a new uh, legendary boss called Endurance of Will, which is a knight. So I don't know if that's going to be on all the new Warzone maps or just Skirmish at Dark Star. I assume just. Skirmish. Yeah, I, I I I hope that they could add it to like maybe they could change up the bosses because it's getting pretty old. Yeah, it is. Um, Tyrant, is which thing. is a new map, which looks pretty cool. Um, just, we don't know too much about it. They, a couple pictures of it, it looks like it's set in space on, like, a crashed station, I believe. Uh, for yeah. Forerunner structure. And yep. then we get to the Rex, which, three new grav hammers. I think that's cool, because we need a new grav hammer. Yeah, the grav hammers, I, I like them in this game, but I don't like them trying to incorporate that Halo 5 touch with all the weapons. Like, they should have just gone without a smart scope thing. The energy sword, it's way too OP now, and it's so annoying. Yeah. And honestly, it kind of ruined Rift Ball a little bit. No, oh, it's still fun. For me. For me, because I don't play Halo 5 Rift Ball that much. Yeah. So I'm not, like, really good with it yet. We get Corpse Maker, Grinder, and Tartarus's Gavel, which I, I think it would be cool if they actually brought in Tartarus's Grav Hammer, but that's that's cool. Um, type thing. And it's Mythic. Um, two new suppressors. Why? No. <laughs> I'm gonna use those all the time. <laughs> um, then we get a whole new set of weapon skins, which I think, which I think looks look really cool. Um, do you like those? I like those. Blue steel. I, Blue steel sub zero. Honestly, I liked the ones that were introduced in that little quick little pack thing they did. Oh yeah, Spartan's armory. Yeah, I like this weapon skins from that, like the blue team one. Yeah. Uh, then we get the Hannibal Mantis and Hannibal Hannibal Scorpion, which are both legendary, and they've got kind of like a uh. Like, Goss type thing going on with them, lasers type thing. I like the cool design on them. Yeah, I like the design. Um, Dynas we were talked about, and then Dynas variants, oh boy. And then we get a new visor that looks what like- What Who cares? No, no. Looks like a crew um, visor. A new Mark IV called Arcadia, yes. Um, Mark IV Gen 1 Arcadia, I don't really know what the difference is, I don't see any difference, except that the armor looks a lot less cooler now. <laughs> It's got, like, polka dots on it. And yeah. then a new Mark V, which also looks somehow worse than the first one. I, I don't know. Still looks bad. Um, two new assassinations, which take a look looks really cool. And then Fist Cuffs looks kind of like every other assassination. Yeah, I hope I hope there's something, like, special about one of them. Yeah, uh, Grenadier, which is an armor mod, I believe. Not too... I never use armor mods. I never even think about them. I use them when I have them, and then yeah. after I use them, it doesn't really occur to me that I actually have them on. <laughs> yeah. Um, Pink Mist, which is a new stance, which I think they should just... I think by the end of all these updates, they should just have a stance for, like, every weapon. Because now they have a Needler one, and it looks cool. I like it. I like it, too. And then a whole bunch of new emblems. Um, I like Super Combine and Distraction. I think I like all these, except Soul, which is that's not really anything. Dog Pound is not my favorite. <laughs> And, uh, money, which, the money one, I like that. That's pretty nice. So... Spectacular. Yeah. <laughs> Overall, there's nothing really new in this. Just a wreck dump, but it's a good wreck dump. And I'm pretty excited for it. To play mm -hmm. on the new map and, uh, to get that Tartarus' gavel. And the yeah. stance. Stance is always good. Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Um, we're gonna keep... If you want, you can, uh, subscribe for more stuff like this. We do this every month with the new updates and... We pretty much stay up to date with all the Halo 5 nudes. Oh, God. <laughs> so, yeah, if you want to uh, keep staying tuned to us for more Halo 5 stuff, then you can do that.